Hello, a form, and then shove the form up my butt. If you want to do a stream. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome. Oh my god, the first thing that came up on stream was just up my butt. <laughs> That's how the stream starts. Oh, this is awful. Oh, no. This is fucking awful. Also, my voice is disgusting. Jesus. All right. So you wanted to start the stream with showing some stuff, right, Biz? Okay. You know you stole on category of the Hobbit, right? I changed it. Okay. Maybe it's just because I haven't refreshed. Don't worry about it. it. Yeah. It should be Sonic. Okay. So there's some very important <laughs> to show off. Like first, the pi pizza pananini. It's too many naan bread <laughs> with with pizza toppings in the middle. There you go. You, know, you show the other one first. This is the reveal shot. This is oh. what it looks like when you open it. Well, this is the one that was that you sent me first. I so how was I supposed to know? See it second. Well, I'm a stinky head. <laughs> Don't call yourself stinky. It's my you job. You called to me call stinky. stinky. Exactly. There you go. B bell says there delicious. Thank you, thank you. I cooked it with my own hands. With my own three hands. I don't have three hands. Why are you lying? Why are you lying? I am the I'm the pizza patini. <laughs> <Patanini. laughs> okay, it's it's a pe okay and it's a pizza. Pizza panini. <laughs> <laughs> Bebo says best voice cute wow you, who gave you permission to be nice to me and make me feel Chan says it sounds myself? really British put googly I mean, eyes I, and gif <laughs> I guess it's a load of appropriated stuff from other parts of the world so by proxy it sounds feels okay British. so you said the last four pictures of your of your sonic OC yes am I supposed to do these in I, reverse order too <laughs> no do these in normal order because that's when they're <laughs> you're made. so confusing Biz <laughs> you didn't ask. Okay. Let's fucking do this. So here's the pic this the is, pixels. This is Biss the Moth. It's ju it's just <laughs> me but Sonic. <laughs> and and they're a moth. But cute. Yeah, I was gonna have them look like on the right, and I was like, you know what? Sonic characters never actually look like insects. <laughs> so let's just get rid of that. No, they're not allowed to. <laughs> and then you had. But my desktop is getting really cluttered. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, you should see my desktop. Is this one? It's just really cluttered. Yeah, and that's me developing them a bit. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I and like then... to imagine they'd, they'd kind of have like a kind of like a you know Meta Knight's like flying and Kirby, how it doesn't really alter your momentum up like sideways, but it just puts you up a bit. Oh yeah, this is like Mania style. <laughs> like an actual like classic Biss the Moth, the Boff. And the next one is the Piss of Resistance. You're gonna love this. <laughs> the, excuse me? I, I don't know what the actual phrase is. I don't want to embarrass myself Oops. by trying to do phrase. Let me get that bigger for so us. I just like to say the Piss of Resistance. Yeah, fucking Sonic Adventure box art Let style. Me... It's a fantastic art style. Let me get this bigger. For us. Oh, thank you, Shan. It, it replace. There we go. Did you, did you just say replace? Yeah. Oh, you you did the thumbnail version of it. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Cute thank Sonic you Soda. Yourself. You're welcome. Okay, and there's there's one last thing I need to show off. <laughs> Wait. Oh, for a second. Oh, you Shan said I want to pet it. I thought I thought Shan said I want to eat it. <laughs> Elena. Why is that what your mind is? <laughs> what the fuck? Oops, also got the small one again. Do you just Why do women like this? Insects? Oh yeah, I fucking showed this off because I was like... Some people Sonic eat insects. I mean, yeah, but I mean, not alive ones. <laughs> the anthropomorphic and the meat at all, but... There you okay, go. so Sonic insects never look like insects. They always just look like bunnies of wings. Insects. Or something. Like, why do they have a muzzle? Insects don't have a muzzle. <laughs> With like a little animal nose. Or a mammal nose. I mean. Vor is about intent, not mechanics. Oops. Wrong button. 
It's Let me just delete all of these to remove some clutter. You do it with horrific intent. A snake That's cannot a word. Fall, even if it eats things bigger than itself, because it does not experience passion for the activity, merely the instinct to survive. That's Golden Spurtle. There's that one. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> what? <laughs> Wait, Golden Spurtle was on screen for like one frame. <laughs> All right, time to open the Sonic game. This reminds me of a YouTube video I watched once, where like it was like some pop culture video, mm -hmm. um, and like somebody just like kept bringing up different pop culture characters, and they're like, "Yeah, if I just happen to bring up fucking Shrek, we can put him in the thumbnail, and it won't be <laughs> lying." And, I, and I, I can't wait to imagine Golden Spurtle's the same. We need to just okay. Can you somewhere. be quiet for a second? I want to see how the volume is on this. Okay. okay. Looks good. I said to make sure I could hear you over it and all that. Okay. War needs to be mentioned at least once, and I need to gatekeep the definition because people just want to expand <laughs> the definition of war to everything. I'm like, no, you can't just make anything being in a mouth. There we go. Vore. Breathing is not like air war. Oh my god, that's Sonic the Hedgehog. Just gonna From do something Sonic here. Sonic the Hedgehog. In Sonic the Hedgehog. So, yeah. the Sonic the Hedgehog. Sega! Do I have controller support set up for... I'm pretty sure I do, for Genesis. Need to stop the video playback or else emulator well, goes think, bingus. Well, I think every legitimate Mega Drive has a Mega Drive controller port, honey. Just plug it in. <laughs> <laughs> it's not working. Oh. That's but it should. I played a Genesis game on stream before. What year was that? Oh, here we go. Earlier this year? Or earlier last? Like, or December. I played it on, on Christmas. Okay, okay so here I we should, go. I should probably explain to chat why we're doing this. Okay, so this... Woo! Okay, so basically, right, um, Elena played all the classic Sonic games a long time ago, right? Um, and a few her years ago. One, a million years ago. <laughs> um, you did something naughty. You tuned into this stream. But yeah, um, basically, Elena's favorite classic Sonic game was Sonic 1, right? Which the fan yeah. base generally doesn't like, because it's the least Sonic of all the classic Sonic games. Um, it kind of like... it's. Oh yeah, you don't have the spin dash. That's right. No. Forget so about that. Oh, because I think I was playing... I think when I played it, I played the version that had the spin dash in it. Although I played it without the spin dash, so I don't... I've just played too many other Sonic games at this point, I think. Yeah. So you have to get a running... You gotta do it like this. Yeah. Woo! So basically Whoa, what lag. me and Elena are do So basically what me and- Oh, thank you! I hope you have a nice sleep. But basically what me and Elena are doing is that she's played a load more Sonic games now. Like, we have just rammed so many Sonic Ooh, games Ooh, I did it! Throat. I remember oh, my only issue with this game is that I remember it was really hard, and it's not very easy to get extra lives. <laughs> so I would end up with like one life and having to use like save states. And then I remember one person, and then I remember I talked about that like in a Miiverse post, and there was somebody who like yelled at me for using save oh, no. states. It's like, how oh, dare you? Like, I hope you some, I hope you play this game again without save states or something like that. Play it the right way. You're just supposed oh, yeah, to go okay. to the. You're just supposed to go to the goal in this, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So it's been too long since I did this. Don't go to the goal that says goal on it. Go to the chaos animal. Okay. Yeah, I didn't. Because the goal remember. that says goal on it kills you. Did you know this is my? This is still my favorite uh, bonus stage in Sonic. I mean, you know, honey, you're allowed to have one problematic opinion. <laughs> it's the least but confusing yeah. and difficult one for me. So basically, the premise of this entire series of us playing the classic Sonic games again is I want to see if all the new Sonic knowledge Elena has has gained allows her to appreciate the other games more than this one. So we're going through them again. Whoops. And I will be talking about why I don't like this game. As well, I, I didn't do that very well. Does like it. That's the thing, I don't like the special stages in this, because you just fumble. They're just fumble zone. <laughs> well, I fumble on them less than I do on special stages in the later games. At least the other ones are exciting and fast. Like, I remember, and like, in attention. Sonic CD, I was very glad that there was another way to get the... Like, that's why I ended up liking it, was because I didn't have to do any special stages. Because I, like, I was the worst. Like, those were the ones I was the worst at, was the ones in Sonic CD. 
I, I'd never completed it a single time in my playthrough of that. <laughs> People like Green Hill Zone because it was their child. I like it because it's There's colorful. No I mean, I don't, it's like, it's okay, okay, here's my thing, right? Like I ended up liking this it's, game. I remember that's another complaint I had the original time I played it, was that I didn't like that it gets less colorful as it goes along. That's like part, I, that's fair. It's part, supposed to be part of the theming, though. Yeah, I just thought it looked more ugly yeah. and like less appealing to look at <laughs> as a game. <laughs> As it but goes. Yeah, people like, I don't think people like Green Hill Zone so much as marketing likes Green Hill Zone. I'm probably not going to get the good ending in this playthrough just because I'm not like, like I did it once and I think I used the save states to make sure that I got enough rings on each place to get them. Sure, it sure is good how the difference between the good Oops. and the bad ending is the size of some flowers. Oh, also, oh, so you oh don't bring equipment. rings across. <laughs> What's really interesting about this game is that in this game they were trying to emphasize rolling more, so you have a speed uh -huh. cap when running, and the only way to go faster than your default speed is to roll. Rockman and roll. No. It's a trap to stop you from going right. <laughs> Oh, it's one of my favorite me verse memes. You're my favorite me vs memes. I'm not a me vs meme. Yes, you are. You're a meme. I'm not a me vs meme. <laughs> no. <laughs> now I'm thinking about that post again. I don't want to be bread. Never mind. Being bread's okay. <laughs> Do, 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 do. I still like the background here a lot. It is quite nice. Interesting It's trivia. got chunky pixels. <laughs> Shit. That's like a thing a lot of classic Sonic games have where they have like big chunky bits in that's the That's probably to, like, that's probably the pixel of it. I was gonna say I feel like that's a form of like trying to de emphasize the background in a way. Mm. Or trying to make it yeah. visually different from the foreground. Yeah, kind of a weird kind of case of like basically lowering the detail and making it look like out of focus almost. Yeah, I was gonna say it's before they could have done blur. They just do chunkier pixels. Okay, so okay, so the checkerboards, right? Um, there's two. Hold on a second here. Right? I'm gonna I'm gonna make the windows smaller on my this end. This was the '90s, right? Um, in the '90s, apparently checkerboards were a bigger thing. Apparently, as a, or like maybe the late '80s. <laughs> like if you look at the part, like apparently a lot of this says like early 3D aesthetic, like checkerboard environments, and you have like the palm trees, which are like very low poly intentionally, mm -hmm. even though they're fucking drawn. <laughs> and also because they're not even pre-rendered about... sprites, they just drew those. <laughs> yeah. A lot of people and don't like this stage. This is one of my favorites. Oh, I fondly one... remember this one. Okay, so you see, the reason why I think Elena likes this game the most out of all of them, but just because she didn't know much about Sonic at the time. Is that this stage is actively the least Oops, a daisy. Stage. And that's why people like me fucking hate this stage. Because this is just bad Mario. <laughs> why am I getting Mario. so much lag? It's this like is bad annoying. licensed platform. Let me close Discord. Also, I'm probably gonna mute and then unmute this for a little bit in a minute. Because unfortunately gonna what? things happen. I'm gonna mute and unmute. Okay. Like BRB for like 30 seconds maybe. Okay. Oh yeah, you said you had to go do this the thing. Here's something that you don't get in Sonic a lot, pushing block puzzles and like pressing buttons. You prefer the look of this stage? Yeah, I like I like the look of this one. This is one of my Oh no This is one of my favorite Sonic stages visually. See this is what I meant by it's really hard. It's like it's only because you don't get a lot of lives, and it's hard to get lives. And uh, this is this is old enough that it was on that arcade style of progression, where you lose all your lives, you start the entire game over from from scratch. I mean, it's not a very long game, but it can be very difficult to do all in one go. So I might end up using save states just so that we can see the whole game. Wow, honey, your Mega Drive can do save states. <laughs> <laughs> I love how this game has so many bugs that just cause Sonic to push nothing. <laughs> like, just mind that he's pushing a shopping cart around. You are saying, uh, this is not something you get in many Sonic games, is pushing blocks to press buttons. Cause it's- cause it's actively just boring. 
I remember I put a lot of work into putting pushing push pushable blocks in gray area, and uh, I remember getting people like saying that that was like sort of the least interesting part of the game <laughs> was my puzzles I made with pushing blocks. I do think that's kind of how, uh, that, I mean that's fair. I mean you know that's that's how people feel about blocks in this game. You're the only person who likes them. I'm the only person the who likes pushing person. blocks. Yes, in this entire game, the only person. <laughs> In games in general. It's weird how inefficient uh, emulation things are. Where it's like, you think, like, I play games that are like a lot more intensive and they use like a fraction of the CPU that emulators use. They like use the entire CPU for some reason. <laughs> I mean, it makes sense because it's, it's not running a game it's running a physical piece it's, of hardware yeah it's like trying it to pre actions. it's yeah it's trying to make a virtual version of a whole game console i guess a it's actually it's easier to uh emulate more recent consoles ironically enough yeah. because they are basically just like computers like they're just basically modern computers especially like the nintendo switch which is just you know just sort of a modern mobile architecture yeah it's basically just... That's why there's like Android emulators that just just work just fine. Like, things like that. Wait, I'm a fuck, Elena, we're clowns! What? You could have just emulated the Android version of this game, which has continues. <laughs> and the spin dash. Yeah, well I couldn't and set that up screen. nearly as quickly. And Knuckles. And, uh, and plus, Tails. I mean, this is the version I wanted to play, too. Like when you said we were going to play the original, I wanted to play the original, so... <laughs> they just work Elena McMemer, a quote by <laughs> It's like, or I don't think we have Nintendo Switch emulation quite yet, just because, you know, it's a current console, so Nintendo is, you know, they uh, really s sprinkle the console, and they have to, like, keep constantly updating the, the hacking stuff. But uh, we have you... we have working Wii U emulators now. Imagine if you just had got like a scone, right? And yeah. you just ripped it apart and on the inside there's a load of tiny little Nintendo switches. <laughs> because they're current. <laughs> da, 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 da. You silly. Yeah, I still have a very much easier time moving around in this game than I do in other Sonic games. The con like, still noticeably. Like the, the player movement physics are the exact same, except there's a speed cap when you're not rolling. And the speed cap... I think it's just because of how the levels are set up, basically. I think, I think that's the thing. Like, I this mean, level, you, I have a really easy time moving through this level. <laughs> I think that's the thing, is, like, you actively enjoy this game because it's the least Sonic one. <laughs> like, this is a lot easier for me than even Green Hill Zone is. <laughs> I mean, I still get spumbust a bit, as you can see, but... It, it's, it's hard for me, because I actively get bored and stop playing well. Just because I want it to be over. <laughs> Whoa! Whee! Man, I gotta step on this block, or else I'm gonna be really spingest later on. Or, no, I'm not. Actually, no. Also oh, playing yeah, at this. Yeah. <laughs> Wait for a second, you're like, yeah, I got invincibility. Let's just get on the block. I was like, well, maybe it's gonna run out before I get all the way there, and I'm gonna need the block to save me. But then I didn't. Sonic has passed. Poor Sonic. <laughs> no. no! <laughs> oh, Shan says, hey, I love pushing blocks. Also, they okay. say this is the least confusing Sonic game I have ever seen. <laughs> I like, like it's, it's, it's like I respect how somebody could appreciate this more than the other ones by virtue of the fact that they just don't like Sonic. It's maybe. interesting. It's interesting that this stage doesn't have parallax on the background. Yeah, it's kind of a weird uh, exception. Although I don't know. Okay, so the Japanese version has like some graphical effects. The Western one doesn't. I don't uh -huh. know if this stage is included like um you have green hill zone uh, -huh. uh in the western version the clouds are all on one layer and the japanese oh, no! one, like, i don't know what have you done 
What have you done? A game over. Okay, so the robots aren't controlled by the creatures, they're powered by them. I hate game overs in this game. <laughs> That's the one thing I don't like. That's one thing I think the, was improved in every other Sonic game. The creatures are being used like batteries, basically. I'm gonna have to use save states, aren't I? <laughs> it's time to save a state, honey. I've, yeah, I don't think I could ever get through this game all in one go. Like, I don't, I've never even managed to get through... I, or no, I've done Super Mario Bros. all in one go. Not when I'm trying to do, like, the speedrun version of it, where I don't get any power-ups. And I do Super Mario Bros. 2 all in one go. We did that on stream. <laughs> <laughs> it's never confirmed how it works, but it could be hamster wheels. I love when you get to, like, games like Sonic Adventure, where, like, the robots are, like, way more serious. Like, you have, like, these and like these bipedal, um, like, 13 foot tall death machines oh, wasn't time to jump machine yet. gun arms and they're still just powered by like a baby bird that's inside mm -hmm. the chassis ouch see i still kind of stink at this game though like i said like this is the bet like i have the easiest time controlling this game and moving around in this game and yet i still run into the same pitfalls that i do in other sonic games <laughs> The level design in this one isn't as great as it gets later on. Like, there's a lot more potential to just run into things. <laughs> like, this game is not too bad with that. Sonic 2 is awful with it. Sonic 3 solves the problem mostly. Oh no! No! What have I you hate done? that it starts you out with no rings. Like, it doesn't bring over the rings you collected from the previous stage. Alina, what and so you can do that. Alina, do you walk immediately into a motorbug? Into a fish. Oh, it's a chomper. And it's so hard to get extra lives in this. I remember, like, never being able to get any more. Like, I don't think I ever got any extra lives in my other playthroughs. Yeah, like, I'm gonna be honest, like, this game kind of is also held back by the life system. So, like, two as well. Yeah. The iOS like and Android I said, it's still... That, though. It's still but going on the, uh... The, um... Like, the arcade style. The games of the, the 80s and early 90s had. I will say though, like. Oh, if I it's missed a contest, the ring. I will say though, um, like, I think with platformers inherently, they kind of. Platformers specifically as a genre, they tend to try and pad themselves out a lot because it's very hard to make <laughs> a long platformer. I was gonna say, because this game is pretty short as a whole. Yeah. If you can manage to do it I mean, all. <laughs> Back then, they just forced you to play it a million times to get to the end because of game over. Yep. Nowadays, you add a load of shit collectibles in every level, and you're like, mm-hmm, you haven't collected 50% of the stars in World 4? Fucking go get them, you piece of shit. Which is <laughs> Sounds like that bad. makes you sound like Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> That's Gordon Ramsay <laughs> as, a, as, a, as a game developer. If Gordon Ramsay was a game designer, he'd make I Wanna Be The Guy. <laughs> And call you a donkey for you couldn't beat this day. <laughs> you fucking donkey! I don't know what his. And in your like. gamer license. <laughs> oh. I love how I didn't know how Gordon Ramsay sounded, so I just assumed he sounds the same as Shrek. I'm just gonna start over. We're just gonna we're gonna do this again. Wait, we're gonna do this again? Yeah, I was down to one life on Green Hill Zone. I'm not gonna make it through the rest of the game. <laughs> You don't get oh. enough lives. <laughs> oh, honey, this is an experience. Like, oh. I like this game. Like, this is my one area of complaint with it, is just the, the lives situation. I love how you say, oh, yeah, well, I have an easier time with this game. And well, this. yeah, I mean, as a whole, but... And I definitely would if the the situation with the lives was better, which apparently they did, as you mentioned, fix that in other versions, but... I, like a poopy head, wanted to play the original. Because I'd never actually done that before, so... <laughs> That's a bit of history. I mean, to be fair, this probably helps you understand why the fanbase doesn't like this one. Because, <laughs> yeah, I played it with the help of save states originally. I want to see how far I can get without them, <laughs> to be honest. Chances I like collecting things. Like, I'm not against collecting things. I just don't I just don't like the fact that like certain games like I guess okay, collecting things for collecting things' sake is fine, right? 
I don't like it when a game is like, mm-hmm, sorry, you've got to fucking... You haven't played it thoroughly enough. Go back and oh, play the Oh, there's the Emerald. Ball. There it is. The Emerald. I can do this. I won't so, Elena, get spingist. Do you know the story of this game? Where Eggman is doing the robot business? Hey, I did okay. it! Okay, so... This is going off of manual. I love the text. background there. <laughs> it's by the way. Special. Like I said, low poly. That's a classic. Like low poly when they don't have to. <laughs> but um, those are guys. Oh, yeah. So basically, um, they're trying to look like Donkey Kong Country when they don't have to. This is before Donkey Kong Country. Honey. This is before Donkey Kong's butt. <laughs> I mean, technically yes, because Donkey Kong, as we know him, was originally actually no. Yeah, Donkey Kong as we know him is the son of Donkey Kong Jr., so you're right. And if Miyamoto <laughs> says that isn't true, once. I'll go to his... No. Remember that scene in the original Super Smash Bros. where, it's, where Donkey Kong's butt is just there for some reason? They're just showing his butt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, okay, so... okay. So also, I, I think... I'll oh, poop. I think the lag at this point is just lag that the game originally had. <laughs> it just occasionally Polygon stutters. I don't think it had any lag originally. It's always Actually, just wait, when there's oh, like a wait, lot of mind, stuff going on. Never mind, you're right. When we've been yeah. maybe on certain screens. Yeah, it's just a little bit. So, it just sort of okay. looks like old game console struggle <laughs> as opposed to Impo emulator struggle. Okay, important story thing, right? Okay? Uh -huh. so, so, in the story for this game in the manuals, right? It is very heavily implied, if not outright stated, that Sonic and Eggman have fought before, right? This uh -huh. isn't the beginning of their feud, right? Yeah. And Sonic originally comes from a place called Christmas Island. Oh yeah, you mentioned the that the other day. The fucking movie they're making! They pretend like he grew up on Green Hill Zone! Like, hey, do you remember that level? That's where he comes from. He comes from the level you remember when you were a baby. That's... that's how it works. And it annoys me. They've just fucking <laughs> retconned part of the character just so that they can fucking shove Green Hill Zone. Did you know that originally I played this game without even knowing how how to roll? Or knowing that that was an attack? I'm pretty sure- I mean, that doesn't surprise me. They didn't figure out rolling in Sonic games until, like, last year. And that's mostly because I yelled at you <laughs> Yeah. I, was like, I also I didn't know that spin dashing or rolling counted as an attack. I thought you could only jump on enemies. I mean, the problem is I think you would just- I think, I think the reason you liked this game the most out of all of them is you were just insistent on playing Sonic like Mario. And this is the <laughs> one where you can get away with that the most. <laughs> oh, sp no! Why is this- I don't even know what noise I just made as a result of that. Oh god, no! <laughs> oh honey, you're, you've got four lives. You gained one somewhere along the way. Oh. Oh, spike bug! You got spike bugged, honey! Because they don't get enough invincibility frames on the spikes. <laughs> oh yeah, Shan, like, rolling is, like, the central mechanic to the entire classic Sonic series. But, like, they do a really- like, the problem is that Sonic is known for being fast, rather than any of the other things that define the series. And it's actively bad. It's actively harmful to the game's reputation. Like, I remember reading that uh, Sonic's running speed in this game is slower than Mario's running speed in Super Mario Bros. For example, yeah. so... <laughs> like, Sonic isn't fast, it's just that he feels fast because he's heavy. It's like a full shopping cart, moving at normal speed feels like it's out of control. And that's what's exciting about it. <laughs> Is, is, well, Donkey Kong is heavy, but he doesn't feel fast. Well, I mean, I mean, what do you? No, I'm not like heavy in the Donkey same Kong, way. Donkey Kong feels like a heavy gorilla. <laughs> I mean, like I don't. I've played Donkey Kong Country. I don't agree. Not in the same way. <laughs> like Sonic feels freight trainy, if that makes sense. Like, <laughs> like low acceleration, low deacceleration. Um, big pooping watch butthole. What you're doing. Also, we it concluded that the train has only half a butthole that's in a crescent shape. <laughs> the conversation that was going on on my stream. Oh yeah, the okay, as so I was trying to figure out what the heck I was doing in Black Mesa, everyone's talking about crescent butts, and I'm like, what? 
I'm trying to figure out this game and everybody's not helping. They're talking about crescent butts, butts on the train, single butthole okay. train. I'm gonna be honest, when you said that line, you it felt like- it, Okay, that line you said felt almost like a Hank Hill line. <laughs> hey y'all, talk about crescent butthole trains and I'm trying to get this game worked out. And down it just had like, Hank Hill energy. <laughs> Oh yeah, the ring system itself is actively designed to forgive kind of loose play. Because you only ever need one. There's no need to collect more than one unless you want a thing. I need um, extra lives, so <laughs> I'm trying to get as many as I can. The speedrunner of this game, I am not. You you set a, you set a save Ouch. A save state at the beginning of this world, right? The beginning no. of this zone. Wait, what? Should I? Like I said, I, I, wanted said... To see how far, I wanted to see how far I could get without them. So, wait, but and then said... and then I'll start using them, because... <laughs> After you get a game over, and start from the beginning again? Yeah. Okay, I mean, you can go... So, so I want to play this. <laughs> I mean, wouldn't it make more sense to do a save state at the beginning of every world? I mean, I will next time. No, but like, okay, so once you get a game over... You've already failed your challenge run. You might as well just pick up on the world you're already on. You might as well just pick up on the little bis. Don't pick up on me. <laughs> Don't on the stream. That's very disrespectful. Don't pick up Don't the bis. Fucking... Don't be fucking. How would you feel if From I school. was bigger than? Okay, no, no, no. You're just being rude. <laughs> Get I your never little backpack. went to school, asshole. Little fairy backpack. Wait, what? Are you saying we're in a little a fairy backpack? backpack? Yeah, you're at school. I'm not. I never went to school. I put I you in the basket on the on the bike, in the bike handles. Okay, that's kind of cute. To be honest, that's kind of cute. <laughs> but fuck you. <laughs> my my bike doesn't even have a basket, unfortunately. Yeah, basically, like basically, Sonic is a game where there's a super mushroom on every platform. And they did that so that you can uh, you can you, you can let your hair down. You can just fuck around. <laughs> you can just and then I shit. still lose all my lives. I mean that's just uh, that's part. I mean to be honest, the thing that started tripping you up this run is mostly spike bug, and that threw you off your game, and then you died. Spike a bug. Afterwards. Okay, so there's a bug in this game where okay, so you know how you said you don't have enough iframes because you jump, you fell on the spikes, and then bounced yeah. onto more spikes and died. It's not that you didn't have iframes, it's just that spikes ignore It's that I didn't have ice cream. Version. No, it's not that you didn't have ice cream. <laughs> also, it'd melt in this fucking level, it's too hot. Just like you? Not in front of the four viewers! <laughs> <laughs> They need to Speaking of which, let me put let me put the uh, let, me, you influencing them. let me put the announcement out again. Boop. Okay, continue. <laughs> <laughs> Ash is here with the key smash. Oh fuck! Key smash, Ash, <laughs> as he's known. <laughs> <laughs> Ash, he does really good key smashes. Chances this level is the perfect temperature. Mm. Look at that! Did you did you notice the 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 sprite? Uh, what's it called? Where they interfere with each other, interrupt each other? <laughs> oh yeah, it's a same. It's sprite line scan line limit thing. Like the NES head. <laughs> yeah, I think it might. Never mind, I was wrong. I was gonna say it might be hard coded, but I realized it wasn't. Sprite flicker is hard coded to deal with it on the NES. Yeah. But in this and on the challenge. and on the Atari, they did oh, that on the Atari uh, even more often than the NES. <laughs> I refuse to acknowledge the existence of Atari. Atari games make me want to be ill. Really? I hate them. I fucking. Sick and here I was thinking that you didn't judge games based on how they look. No, it's not how they fucking look. It's the fact that everything is infinitesimally jank. <laughs> Everything is like Babby's first game maker project, but they. I remember. Uh, I remember hearing that basically, like, it's a miracle that there are any games on the Atari because, like, there was no document. Like, it's like the most low-level programming imaginable. There's no documentation for it whatsoever. 
People just get their computer and then you it's just figure it out. Loser. And also you I... have to you have to program by hand the drawing things to the screen. Like the like the, the yeah. console doesn't just do that for you. You have to make it do all of that stuff. <laughs> so yeah, like this doesn't surprise me. I don't think you Apparently it was like the worst thing to develop for like ever. <laughs> like <laughs> I had uncles Everything else was better <laughs> to, to, to program for. I had uncles who programmed for similarly powerful systems from Europe. Oh, about the same time. that didn't go very well. Like in their own time, as kids. Mm -hmm. Like as hobbyists, <laughs> as kids. Yeah. You had to basically be a computer scientist to program for the Atari. Because <laughs> yeah, they just didn't uh, give you anything to work with. <laughs> Yeah, and it's amazing, because at this point, I'm a game developer, and I'm a fucking clown who doesn't know anything. <laughs> Half of my time as a game developer, I didn't know you could times a number. <laughs> I would just divide by less... I, oh wait, no, was it... Yeah, I'd just divide by less than one. The <laughs> headers look like the Seinfeld logo? Oh my god! I can see that! I mean, it was about the same era. That was 90s aesthetic. Yeah, 1991. You this is from. You heard me, Ash. I would. And what's blinking? Less than one. Oh, Ash, you should have seen the. Like, okay, Wait, so what? Watching... Wait, what were you saying, Biss? I missed. I was paying attention to something else. I was paying attention I to what said, Shan was saying. I said, I used to not know you could multiply a number, and I divide by less than one. Oh. Amazing. Oh my fucking god. Okay, you know what I used to- Okay, I need to tell you. I once made a score counter in an old game of mine, right? Okay? Every single digit of the score counter was its own entire ass object that had a sprite animation from 0 to 9. And it would pick which frame of the sprite animation it did by taking the variable oh, that was it. show. And then depending on the, the digit, dividing okay it did, oh no it did something weird right okay so imagine you have a variable that can like like some sort of score counter that goes into the thousands right i had the last digit of that the last digit of that score counter was an object that would go okay wow get the score, i lost them all we're gonna so you get the score right okay you remove a thousand if it's over a thousand you do that nine times or ten times if it, you remove a hundred if it's over a hundred ten times you remove ten 10 times if it's over 10 and then the number you're left with will be the last digit of the score and then it changes its anime like its sprite to that I... <laughs> do you even understand what i mean and then there'd be like do several I... digits with different amounts of how much they would subtract and check so you're doing frame. it like like an abacus <laughs> i guess like <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> or like, sounds like how you have to do binary. Oh binary god. numbers. Oh, uh, thank you, thank you, Shan, thank you. But yeah, it was awful. Oh my god, the thing I got the most roasted over though, is I fucking... I, you know that thing where you press tab and, and the, it makes some spaces? Mhm. Mm I didn't know that was a thing. So my code was fucking hideous. For like the longest oh. time. It was or, or like yeah, you press ta ugly. tab to indent it. Yeah, like no fucking indents. <laughs> and that's when I started oh doing God. fucking GML. Uh, originally I was just doing drag and drops. And that dragon. fucking thing I just... You know that thing I drop. described with the number? Where it like removes a thousand ten times, a hundred ten yeah. times, and ten ten times? That was all in drag and drops. It was like a drag and drop that took like 30 seconds to scroll down. So it was a drag and drop dragon. <laughs> dragon, dragon, drag and drop, drag and drop d game. <laughs> Instead of an abacus, it's an abacus. ababus. <laughs> that just sounds like a band that I would listen to. I mean, there's a band called ABBA. Yeah, I, I know, honey. I, I live in Europe. <laughs> Do you think <laughs> I don't know about fucking ABBA? I mean, I don't know where ABBA's from. They're from Sweden, I think. <laughs> I, See, I, I listen to a lot of music. I recognize a lot of music. I know nothing about the musicians. 
<laughs> I'm the same with most things, but Abra is so ridiculously popular. It's like, you can't not know about Abra over here. It's like <laughs> Abba fucking, what's his name? Abba fucking, what's his name? The other guy. Um, David Bowie, you know about David oh, Bowie. Oh, David Bowie. Bowie. <laughs> I don't think he was wrong about his own fucking name, Malena. Stop being American, <laughs> for God's sake. <laughs> fucking David Bowie. It's funny that you're the only person I've ever heard say that. I guess, according to you, he said that, so... I guess okay, I just I'm haven't heard it. I'm Googling this. David Bowie... ...saying his own name. <laughs> I always like to bring up, whenever I hear about things like that, I like to bring up that Dr. Seuss pronounced his name Dr. Seuss. <laughs> you think I'm right, Chan? About what? Spring Yard Zone. Oh, I love this music. Oh, isn't this the, isn't this the weird stage where it says cope? Is this the cope no, stage? Yeah, it's probably going to be the cope stage. I've always been confused by that. Nobody's ever given me an answer. Oh yeah, this is the cope stage. Nobody ever has given me an answer for what that's supposed to mean and why that's there. Does it make it? I don't understand why it says cope. Cope soda? <laughs> As says Dr. Soy Soyce-os. Soy sauce. Oh my god. Oh, yeah, I'm okay, going to get... So how many times do you think I'm going to get squashed? Oh, honey, I can't wait to see you just get squashed. There you go. I'm I in a, a safe state for you, Biz. Go. We all come to stream to watch Elena get squished. That's what we're into. Oh, God, I missed all the rings. I'm going to die. Oh, okay, here's rings. I don't cope with this stage. I guess that's what it's trying to point out. <laughs> I'm not coping with with this very well at the moment. I like this stage. This is one of my favorite ones in this game, because it's one of the few ones where you actually engage with Sonic fucking mechanic. D no, the, the fucking was for emphasis. Please don't, Ash. Please. <laughs> he didn't even say anything yet. I fucking could feel it coming. Whoa. <laughs> Oh, honey, I got, a, I got a bad feeling that you're gonna get squashed again when you do, I'm gonna fucking paste you out. Oh, it's it's nothing, Ash. Nothing happened. Don't pay any mind to us. Nothing. There's no joke possibilities here. For a second, I thought that was Metal Sonic rolling down the hill coming to get me. Nah, it's just an armadillo robot. I thought it looked like a chicken. Are you sure it's an armadillo? I'm... I thought that was a chicken robot. Okay, who's the Sonic fan here? Me. It looks entirely like an armadillo! I'm the fan of this game. Yeah, well, I'm the fan of everything Sonic. You don't even know what disease Shadow the Hedgehog was created to cure. <laughs> you don't even know what disease Sonic has. Sonic looks like doesn't have a disease. Sonic under the effects of the disease. I'm gonna fucking kill you. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Okay, Why so, um, who won't, okay, so, at some point- Who knew a stream of Sonic out. would have so many Donkey Kong references on it? <laughs> also, nice, this game doesn't have any bottomless pits that I'm aware of, or that I remember. It hasn't had any yeah, so far. It has a lot of bottomless pits. It has loads of them. Really? You know, some in Green Hill Zone. Really? Yeah. So I'm a poopy head? Oh, thank you. Thank you, Shan. I pretty much am. I'm pretty much the best at that. Also, maybe Kirby. Like, Elena's on the Kirby wiki, and I even correct her about some things sometimes. <laughs> she comes to me, she's like, Oh, Biss, Addo and Adeline are different characters. No, they're fucking not. Why would they have two characters? I remember there was a big de There was actually a big debate about that on the Kirby wiki, and then they decided that they are separate characters. That was the, the consensus of the debate. It's wrong! Because recently surfaced concept art of Kirby 64 specifically says, draw this character this way, not the Dreamland 3 way. Because they're the same <laughs> character. Why would it be, why would they make why would they be like, okay, in the last game we had a character whose name was Addo, um, and looked exactly like this. Let's make another character with the same abilities. 
who looks the same and acts the same and is You think it's funny that there's a, been a debate on the Kirby Wiki? You want to know what another debate was about? It was about whether or not characters' feet are shoes or not. Whether it's just their feet or if they're wearing shoes. That was a big debate. I would argue that usually it's, sh it's shoes, unless stated otherwise. Like, yeah, I was going to say, my my argument for that was that it should be stated that they are feet, unless it, it's explicitly shown that, they're, that they are shoes at some point, which in some cases they are, but most of the time not. I oh, said the they're definitely are... feet, but they're not definitely shoes, so we should say shoe. We should say feet because that's what they definitely are. <laughs> okay, so the blinky bars, Shan, are basically just—they're just like neon lights, right? Like this is kind of a neon light sort of place. It's like a more abstract casino type thing than what yeah, they ended up doing in later stages in later games. I mean, it took me years to realize that this was a proto casino stage. Yeah, <laughs> prosino stage. The, I mean, yeah. the original Sonic the Hedgehog was kind of just more sort of abstract than the other games were. Yeah, in its designs. <laughs> this stage has no parallax detail either, I just noticed. Interesting. This is a fun stage, this is nice. If you look at uh, Sonic CD, you'll notice that most of the stages are basically just interesting remixes of stages in this game. And that's because <laughs> Sonic CD was originally going to be a remake of this. It's kind of like how the uh, Oracle games, the or Zelda Oracle games, were originally going to be a remake of Legend of Zelda. Yeah, and how um, uh, oh. Link's Awakening was originally a remake of Link's The Past. Interesting. Wait, what do you mean, Blinky? Do you mean the shield? Sonic's blinking because of the shield that's on them? And I that's swear like I see a chicken beak and like and like the the thing on the top of it. Look, look, it's got the little red thing on the top of the chicken head. It's an armadillo. I saw I that. Can get you What's the what is that called? Like the crest? It looked like the chicken's like crest. And okay, so I thought, and it has like a pointed nose that looks like a beak. Okay, that's it was it. a I'm chicken. Sonic one enemies. And they're making it pretty far. On one life. Wait a second. Why is it that the first enemy that comes up if you search Sonic 1 enemies is the first boss of Shadow the Hedgehog? <laughs> Elena, I have a picture of the armadillo. It's going in your fucking inbox. And then you can admit that I was right and it's an armadillo. My audience seems to have been less interested to come watch me play the original Sonic than they were to come watch me play other stuff I've been playing recently. I think, I, think we got, I think we got more viewers for Sonic 4 than we did for this, and that was also kind of low. I think it doesn't help as well that this is the last thing you're streaming in the night. Oh, a load of people are going to bed. <laughs> oh yeah, oh, I still yeah. keep trying to spin dash sometimes, do you notice that? <laughs> Aww. Too used to that by now. Like, the shields in this game are like, kind of boring looking and boring in mechanically, so it's easy to just not even notice when one's appeared until you're like, well, what's that? Disappointingly, I have to deal with these. This is probably where I die. I like would like to say that when we get to like, Sonic 3 and Knuckles- This like, is where I die! Oh no, no, I made it. Oh my god. I've got a squish emote just waiting in chat for when you eventually die. <laughs> How did you make that, by the way? Is that just using the bis points? Yeah, using the points. I didn't know you could squish an emote. <laughs> yeah, it's one of the beautiful yeah. magics that have been allowed to me. It seems like, of any emote, this is the perfect one to do that with. Well... Yeah, because then the sitter is... Couldn't get my rings speak. back. Well, time for save state. Also, oh my, oh, well you got to spring yard zone, honey. I'm proud of you. Also, you <laughs> didn't get squished, but I'm still posting it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, you took my advice. You restarted at the beginning of the zone. Yeah, I told you. Oh, it means a lot that you take my advice. <laughs> I was gonna work on a drawing today, but. I really just want to keep doing programming stuff after this, so I think I'll save it for tomorrow. Hell yeah, honey. I mean, I think Sonic's, uh, Sonic always gets me in the programming mood. I mean, I was already in the programming mood, so... 
Sonic always helps me maintain my program. <laughs> I wasn't really feeling the drawing today. And I'm just imagining you groping a canvas. <laughs> also, you got a close-up look at that thing. It's definitely an armadillo. It looked like a chicken to me. Look in your inbox. It's got a chicken There's beak. A drawing of it. It does. It, it, that's its head. That's its whole ass oh, Monaco's head. Monaco's here. Yo, Monaco. It looks um, like a chicken. Wait, Bungus. It's a chicken. It's not fucking chicken, Elena. It's Is not it a chicken? chicken. <laughs> it's making me think of that vine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is that a chicken? Wait, is that a vine? Yeah. Holy shit. Yeah, it was a vine. Your butt's a vine. How does that make you feel? Like a vine. Oh my god. Shan posted cat pic. Oh my god. Oh my god, Elena, you need to pause and look in the server in a second. Okay. You need to see this. You, need to you finished see a really this. bad Bungus drawing? You gave up halfway? Oh. <laughs> well, I want to see anyway. Oh, there it is. <laughs> oh, I like it. It's Bungus. Can you still do the Bungus voice? I don't remember what it was, unfortunately. Oops, let me... I got the small gun again. I need to quit with that. Big oh, Bungus. That's a cute kitty. That's a very really cute kitty. I want to pet the kitty. Also, Elena, show the armadillo. It's in your inbox. Yeah, I will. There's so Bungus. I'm, like, <laughs> I'm Bungus. That's the voice, I think. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's yeah. me. On his yeah, dream big again. <laughs> big Chungus Bungus. <laughs> big Chungus Bungus. And. Imagine if Chungus and Bungus did date. And here, down. the cat. The Shen cat. Oh, look at that precious baby! <laughs> Watching the stream. Does cat let you pet Tum Tum? Does cat let you pet Tum Tum? Now, show <laughs> the truth, Elena. And, hit, and, and now I'm gonna show you the chicken. It's not a fucking chicken. The rolling chicken. It's not a chicken. Chicken. Look at that chicken. Roll. It's got a, a beak and everything. Chicken. No, that's its head. <laughs> that's its entire ass armadillo <laughs> head, and it has ears. And look, armadillo heads don't have beaks. It doesn't. It's not a beak. That's its entire head. <laughs> and then it, has, it, ends it doesn't like... have wings. It doesn't have a chicken tail. It's a fucking armadillo. It's a chicken to me. It'll always be a chicken in my heart. <laughs> You've disgraced the legacy of. Let me look up the name of this thing again. Uh. I what's it to the foyer. Oh. I have a little surprise for you. Wait, where can I find the names of these fuckers? I know they have names. <laughs> I played the vine. Kylie Jenner to the foyer. I have a little surprise for you. Oh, his sprite sheet has them. You've disgraced the <laughs> legacy chicken? of Rose. He's holding a pig. Thing. By the way, so in that video, the person is holding a pig. I got a surprise for you. <laughs> is that a chicken? It's like a it's little baby not, piglet. It's not a woodlouse, Shan. It's an armadillo. Nobody it's believes an it's an armadillo. <laughs> Unless it's named Andy, it's not an armadillo. I don't know why that's the case, but in my in my brain it made sense. In my brain it made sense that it has to be Andy the Armadillo, if it's an armadillo. I'm gonna cry out you for in my life. <laughs> it's a semi-dillo, Minako says. <laughs> it's a semi-dillo. It's semi-dillo. Okay, it has armadillo amounts of legs. It's a dill. It's a dillo like. It's a di it's a dildoid. Excuse me. <laughs> we don't say that dildoid. on my stream. <laughs> I can say what I want on your stream. You don't say that on my stream. Oh fuck! Yes, Shan I got Shan's agreement, and Shan knows more about animals than anybody else here. 
typing. You got through ba -ba -ba -ba. actual of the spring yard zone. Again. Again. Stall odds. <laughs> oh wow, I don't be mean to stop. Oh my god, I love this section. There's a big ass half pipe and you can do some really cutesy rollsies. Whee! That one group of rings oh. there looked like something. It, what did it do? It looked like an arrow, honey. <laughs> mm. Arrow, didn't it? It's like an arrow, honey. <laughs> you look, honey, you can't just look at that arrangement of rings and say it looks like a PP and ball. It does not look like PP and ball. <laughs> you can't just be like, honey, what are you? Like four? What are yeah. you? An idiot sandwich chef. That's right. Ali has a dirty mind, says Monaco. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, a lot of us do, it's just that some of us know how to not, <laughs> not state out loud that an arrangement of rings like a pee-pee. <laughs> some of us have restraints, some of us take our job fucking professionally. And then there's people like me who just watch too much wine sauce. He, he always points it out if it even remotely resembles anything like that. That's because it takes a PP to know. <laughs> I think yeah, it's just because he knows that his chat will point it out uh, before him if he doesn't. <laughs> so he just well, has to preemptively point it out. That feels kind of sad. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like the PP <laughs> gets out one way or another, either you unleash it or other people unleash it upon you. It's like when he was playing Chrono Trigger, he was like. He was like, chat, there's there's Robertson's on screen right now. And he's like, as if I had Robert to point that out for you. You probably noticed that before I did. <laughs> Robertson's? Yeah. What the fuck? Is that a term for a pippy? No. Those started as Bob. Because they removed one letter. And then from there, he started calling them Roberts. Wait. And then from there, Robertson. <laughs> How does removing one letter from PP get you with No, Bob? that's not- no! <laughs> oh, boom! Yes. Sorry, I forgot- You had to solve the puzzle. Wait, so what's the boop puzzle? The puzzle. <laughs> exactly. Sound you make oh, I got an extra life! What, like I'm what sound? Well, I didn't get the Chaos Emerald, but I got an extra life, so at least there's that. Maybe the real Chaos Emerald was the extra life you got along the way. Was the extra life in your butt? Well, Do you think wait, the special wait. stakes take place up, or up Sonic's? No, I hate you. I hate you an unspeakable amount. If you <laughs> ever even insinuate that. They take place in the special zone, which is a dimension parallel Oh, to oh, Shan is saying the Seinfeld logo is when it says Sonic has passed the whatever act and it has that yellow, like, oval. Oh yeah, that's what I said. I mean, that's okay, why yeah, I, I missed, it. yeah, I didn't, I wasn't catching that. Sorry. <laughs> I'm, oh, I'm a poopy head sometimes. Hello, Afro Wave. Yeah, it's kind of nostalgic. Well, okay, it's not nostalgic to me because I only ever played this on Sonic Nostalgic to me. And don't like it. Wait, what happened to Is my that... extra life? I only have one. In fact, the first time I actually really liked this. I only game have one was... life. Oh no! I already okay, had one you... life. You know that? You know the extra life sound you get in special stages? Yeah. I think that might actually be getting you a continue. Oh. I think. Well, Maybe. that would be nice too. <laughs> Yeah, I never liked this game growing up. The first time I've actually been able to appreciate this game is the iOS and Android version, because it has widescreen and also not a live system the same way. Ba, 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 da, da, da. Do you ever just sometimes think of Arlo? Thankfully not. Oh, you get shields from item boxes, Shan. Yeah, I have like okay. So there's always like a YouTuber who's annoying me any given week, <laughs> and it's usually not because they're bad. It's usually because they're just like mediocre. They yeah, I don't want to be mean, but I really dislike Arlo. 
Like, like yeah, he we watched, I remember we, you and I watched like one video of his. I don't think we finished it because both of us were just tired of it. Mm. I don't even yeah. remember what the topic was. Like he just, like he, like no, like he just sort of goes, "Oh, Nintendo might do something." I talk about Nintendo. Oh, I'm gonna just give you the most I, basic gamer opinions. Ooh, I decided I didn't like him after right? he did, what? after he did like the extremely like over the top, the Pikmin 3DS game hurts me. Video. Okay, you know <laughs> that what? was what it was titled. Thing, right? Like I'm gonna be honest, right? Okay, mm -hmm. like here's the thing, right? Um, is like. I understand his annoyance of the Pikmin 3DS game or whatever, but I like, really like that time. game. I mean, it's probably an alright game. I'm just it I, has I great music. <laughs> I just understand why somebody would be annoyed by that potentially because they might worry, oh, is the series future riding on a game which has nothing in common with the mainline series? <laughs> it was a really chill game. Hmm. But yeah, like I don't know. It's like it's like just yeah, I don't like him. He has these really uninspired. Like he did that. He did a fucking video about Pokemon Sword and Shield. And he's like, oh, well, it's on the Switch, so why does it look like Breath of the Wild? You know what they could just hunk it down and get some graphics out of this. Because they, they, the they didn't work on it for five years. Yeah. Also, Breath of the Wild has less shit in it than Pokemon Sword and Shield. <laughs> like, how many enemies are there in, so in Breath of the Wild? There's like five, right? Yeah, There's well, that's something people, people complained about, actually, with Breath of the Wild. So there wasn't yeah. very much enemy variety. It so gets what? a little samey. <laughs> Pretty quickly. That's, like, that's, just, that's just the thing with games is that you can't. You even there's a certain amount of quantity slash quality juice you can put in, and people <laughs> just complain if they can't have everything. Well, I mean, I and like Nintendo everything. is not a company that just makes like one game. You know, like there's ones where like the people who make Grand Theft Auto like it's kind of just they the company just makes Grand Theft Auto yeah. <laughs> pretty much. Also, or, Red Dead well, I mean, uh, yeah. Just Grand Theft also, That's but, why they yeah. only like put out one game like every like, I don't know, like five or six years, I think. <laughs> so like, <laughs> whereas in, like, so like they have like, the whole company is just focusing on one game, whereas Nintendo is always making a bunch of stuff, and they have like small teams making each thing. So. So basically, I don't know, it's just, just I'm not, I'm, uh, there's like a load of these channels, but Arlo's just the one that I'm obsessed with at the minute. Before that, it was like Dan Root, video game animation study. I don't <laughs> like that guy just because like his videos always feel like he doesn't put like much heart into them. Like that one time that he showed like Benny an Kirby animation. says, it's Sonic. <laughs> it, it really is just Sonic. But yeah, like the, this Dan Root animation study guy, right? He does this video about the evolution of Mario's Cope. run cycle or whatever. Um, it's Cope time again. I like he, he can press. Oh well, hold on. I want to say I like he can press okay. down to roll, and it works even if it's like upside down. <laughs> yeah, it's quite nice. Monaco <laughs> <laughs> squished you. You've been squished. <laughs> but yeah, what was this? Okay, I'll quickly finish. It's long story short, right? Okay, he shows oh, this animation error. of Mario running from Paper Mario, right? Which is three frames, and he's like, "Yeah, you got this animation from Paper Mario, which is about oh, two frames." Oh, pooping. I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> Three is, a, is is about two, but no. why would you say it like that? I know, right? Oh, yeah, I did get to continue. Oh, yeah, cool. And it starts me at Act 3, too. Neat. Wow, there's I got three lives again. Acts. Excuse me? <laughs> joking, because you said it starts me on Act 3, too. Thirty-two acts sounds like thirty-two X. Oh my god, honey, we need to play Knuckles Chaotix on stream. You need to yeah, you keep mentioning that. I need to ask Shiny about that. Go to Shiny and be like, Shiny, can you help me shut up Knuckles Chaotix? <laughs> Maybe I can get Normal. her to come watch that stream. Normal people. Shit. Elena. Poopy. <laughs> That's what Monaco yeah. says. <laughs> the, the little face goes with that well for some reason. <laughs> Isn't it? It does. It really <laughs> does. I love how face we've got there. this lovely little aloof Elena face. <laughs> it's very I good. Love the, I love how this emote just works out of context, but also if you know the context, it has other uses. <laughs> Hello, Kitty Queen. You got a nice username. 
Kitty Queen says, ooh. I mean, that's what We've got an ooh in chat. <laughs> did you see did you see what I posted in the server last night where I was like I feel like Biss made this sound? Oh my god, Elena. Fuck. What? There's a lesbian kissing in chat. <laughs> of myself? Elena kisses Elena. This is the shit of the year. <laughs> hmm? Uh hold on a second. Mute. Okay, you can mute. Go ahead, I'll I'll entertain the audience. Um Yo, what's up? Insert town or city name about the weather. Okay, seriously that whatever. Fuck that bullshit. How y'all doing? What has have you been tonight? I'm alright. Personally. I'm like slightly tired. I've had a long day. Yes, yeah, same Shan, like. Honestly, just the time I've spent watching the stream feels like 12 million hours. It's been a long day full of long things. <sighs> Don't you fucking taunt me, Monaco, I swear to god. Also, Monaco, your name always amuses me, because the character in Dragon Ball with a very similar name, Dragon Ball Super, who's just a weird little, like, minimum wage working teenage alien. That a god has managed to convince Goku into thinking is like the most powerful warrior in the universe. So like you have this like little like this little run alien, um, you have this little run alien who's basically being paid minimum wage to pretend he's the strongest warrior in all of existence. And 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 like basically they just keep coming up with excuses for Goku to never fight him. It's like Goku, no, you must never fight Monaco. <laughs> They're too strong. You wouldn't be. He'd, he'd get angry. He'd destroy the earth if you fought him. You need to get stronger before you challenge him. Oh, uh, yeah, that's pretty much you. That's pretty much you. Oh fuck. <laughs> Dragon Ball Super is a weird show because it's got some. It's got some good funny stuff in there. Like how there's an oracle that knows everything in the multiverse, but in order to I don't, was it no no oh I remember no okay there's like in Dragon Ball Super there's like a giant set of Dragon Balls where every ball is the size of a planet, but they're stored across two universes, and the only way you can activate them is to speak in the ancient angelic language and say, peas and carrots. Like, you know, like, like, please and carrots, like, please and carrots out. And it's like a play on words thing. But basically, just please and carrots. And the Let's dragon is activating. You get a dragon that's as big as the universe. The only th so, the I first may, thing like, I hear when I come back is just please and carrots. And I'm so confused. <laughs> oh my god, Shan, yes, yeah, same. I also don't like how they made. Oh my god, I was complaining about this recently. I, uh, actually, I was in a call with Elena when I did this. I don't like the fact that they make Vegeta. You know, you know, that, you know how in Dragon Ball Z, Vegeta has that amazing emotionally Ooh. affecting moment where he explodes himself. In Sometimes a it's hard sacrifice. to get up hills in this game. <laughs> yeah, that's the point of the game, Elena. The hills is hard. Hard yes, hills. The point. If you look remember at the yesterday. Concept, uh, remember how yesterday I said Pac Man is made out of a hard outer man that's that's covering the soft inner Pac. I prefer my head cannon that he's just covered in yellow fur, and if you shave him, he's like all like the color of a shaved cat. I just liked the phrasing of that. I don't even know how I came up with that. I come up with some interesting things when I'm just talking with Cassie. It's a very Elaine thing to say. But yeah, where was I going? <laughs> I was just saying. I, I was talking to Elaine about this yesterday. I hate the fact that in Dragon Ball Super they have Vegeta. Oh no! Did you see that? <laughs> do his ah! heroic sacrifice. What happened? Spiked, honey. Literally. Instantly. But yeah, they Hope have him do his heroic explode himself to defeat a villain thing again, where he blows himself up with his key to save the world from a villain. But this time he just survives. He survives. I'm reaching that point where I'm like getting worse at the game. <laughs> that always seems to happen to me for some reason. That could happen when we were playing Horus, remember? <laughs> oh yeah. I think you just need to chill out, honey. You just need to calm. Chillax. Yeah, chillax. You need a bird. A burb? 
Need to get the bird out of the robot. Oh. Fun fact, the birds that come out of robots predate Sonic and are originally from a Sega arcade game called Flick. Yeah, I remember this. Well, that ring did a did an interesting thing up on the left there. It really did. Really you did. I Oh, also fun fact. Why do I struggle this... so much with these sections? <laughs> I believe every one of the small animals in Sonic 1 has a name that ends in Y. You have like Flicky, Hoppy, Wednesday. I, 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 want to, I need to look up the names. Hold on a second. Animal buddy names. Frankie? No. Stop it. Spanky? Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Okay. Their names Flaky. are. Oh, no, no. I was wrong. I was wrong about them. Okay, so their names Spongy. are. Spongy. Rick. Their names are. Ricky, Stringy. Pocky, Flicky, Sorry. Rocky, Pecky, Picky, and Cookie. <laughs> Cookie. <laughs> Spanky! No! <laughs> Get out of here! This is the second time on stream today I've mentioned spanking. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> that was a real experience the first time you did it. Oh my god! Oh, honey! That was fucking top level play! You fucking what? ran up the wall, jumped off the wall to go to the other side of the half pipe, ran through, <laughs> invincible. That's glorious. <laughs> but thank you. That was, such a, that was such a good moment of Sonic gameplay. I'm proud of you. I didn't even do it on purpose. <laughs> okay, never mind. I rescind all my compliments. <laughs> it just kind of happened. So it says more about the game than it does about me. That that happened. Yeah, the potential's there to do it on purpose. And next purpose. time I play this, I will. Yeah. Ah! Not doing Whoa. <laughs> I make some noises on stream. Oh, Elena, no, not in the pit. <laughs> oh my god. Not in the can... armpit. Elena, when you upload this to YouTube, can you do me a favor? Mm hmm. You have a sound from Super Mario 64 where you break open a cork box that goes boink! <laughs> oh, Can you Monaco? Add that to every that's that's a name of a ghost in Pac-Man arrangement. I don't know if you were here when I played that, but that... he sat on me. But yeah, can you add that to every time Eggman breaks a block? Doctor Eggman sat on me. <laughs> Are we back to fucking ass smothering for the second time tonight? <laughs> Eggman smothers a late in a ten-hour ASMR. No. Time for the squish mode, I guess. <laughs> Do this, yes. I hope eventually someday I get as big as Vine Sauce and I just have a million <laughs> emotes for like a million different situations. <laughs> oh my god, Monaco! <laughs> you would not believe how many emotes that Vine Sauce has. Elena, can you see what Monaco just put? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> well, honey, after all the time we spent memeing about you sitting on things, this is like your ironic punishment. No, I get sat on. Great. <laughs> Could somebody please draw this? <laughs> so I have room for two more subscriber emotes. I keep mentioning this. Uh, I, we, we still need to come up with two more. Okay, so we've got your face when you're sitting on something, right? Yeah. Oh god, let's think what else what else is things to do with your stream? Um I mean people keep asking for the butt one, but it's like, I don't know, do we need it? <laughs> like <laughs> really? I think that the face is good because it implies the butt. Yeah. Like you don't even have to show the butt. You just know that she's sitting. You're beginning to think and not English? <laughs> yeah, Ash is the one who keeps suggesting the butt, so he says, do the butt, yes! <laughs> you're gonna pay $9.99 for the butt? <laughs> but, like, it has to get through Twitch moderation, and the butt might not. Yeah, that's true. Also, the butt from the meme image is in, like, black leggings, and it won't show up well. Yeah. <laughs> Ash says he will pay $9.99 for it. <laughs> Nine ninety nine, like nine dollars ninety nine cents. Yeah, 
Like one of this, one of the subscriber emotes is for 4.99 tier, and one of them's for the 9.99 tier. Oh shit! Wait, I thought the emotes were time based, not payment based. Apparently they're payment based. Well, I don't know. That's what it said. I'd have to look into that more, but. I guess that's I how much you have to pay, like, overall to get it. At one point, you wanted to do ones of, like, your co-hosts, right? Yeah. Like, I'm kind of against that by default, because I'm- I, am, <gasps> I, I found an extra life! To... Oh shit! Good job, honey! Exciting. Oh goodness, and then I almost lost it. <laughs> What if instead of checkpoints, they were called cheek points? And it's just a butt you run through? <laughs> well, I thought it would be like pointy cheeks, like cheekbones. What if you had, what if, what if you had cheekbones both in your face and your butt? No, 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 that's it. I mean, you kind of do. It. No! They're, they're called the sit we bones. Are, no! No! We are not doing this. We are not- I will leave the stream. If you, you don't like the fact that, that sit bones exist? Elena, I will come to your yes, house. Yes, I finally did it. And I will spray paint your entire house piss yellow. And I will dress you in a clown suit as you sleep. <laughs> <laughs> I'm right. <laughs> Cheap points. No! <laughs> Mainly to spite oh. Biss. Minako oh, says she, she, she agrees. Why am I the enemy of the people? What have I ever <laughs> done to deserve this? Because you don't like sit bones? It Labyrinth gross. zone. You want something soft to sit, not something hard and unforgiving and splinterable like a bone. It's part. It's part of your hips. Oh, I mean, Monaco's right. I am pretty bullyable, to be honest. Well, and I'm even more so, and that's why you bully me. In return. I do really pull the fuck. I think you're so in your in your announcement of this of the stream you called me stinky. That's true. I think it's a weird situation though. Oh yeah, you're like... right about the glitch where Sonic just pushes things randomly. Yeah. I don't know what he yeah, even thinks he's pushing. But I was saying, um, I think nobody I think people don't actively bully you much because you're such an easy target that they aim for me instead to make themselves feel better. And Biss then has, I prey on you. Yeah, Biss, Biss has no trouble going for the low-hanging fruit. <laughs> I mean, you're just insulting yourself at this point. <laughs> you're the low-hanging bully bait. <laughs> you do, in fact, love Bone Shan. So when I so when I played this game previously, originally I played the 3DS version, which was in 3D, which was kind of neat. They did a good job making this in 3D. Well, the 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 3D the Sega 3D Classics series was really good. I only had the Sonic ones, but uh, the other ones looked pretty good too. Like in Sonic 2, they did. You know how there's like the tube, uh, like the half pipe bonus yeah. stages. They did that in 3D, and that was really cool looking. Oh, nice. They added 3D depth to that. They put a lot of work into those. You like Sega seems to is. Sega seems to care about their their legacy content more than most other game companies do. And also, unlike Nintendo, they're willing to admit when stuff they made wasn't perfect the first time and fix it. Yeah, exactly. Like you don't hear about all these additions being made to classic Nintendo games. All poop. That's because Nintendo's business model is to like sue emulation websites out of business yeah, and then just like... sell their ROMs on. Yeah, you would, you don't hear about like all Nintendo ads is uh, um, save states. The save states aren't even in the ROM; they're just in the emulator, so it's not even adding yeah. them. And they add, uh, they just they have some like visual changes you can make. That's it. And but and by visual I mean like borders <laughs> or like aspect ratio. That's it. Nothing significant. I think one of my, the things that makes me most angry. And remember, Nintendo like, and they like decide is, how you're supposed to play their old games. Like, wasn't there the thing with the Nintendo 64 games being like dim or something? Because they thought that was better. Yeah, they did. Didn't make it an option. They're just like, you're just gonna play these games dimmer because we think that you should. <laughs> also, what annoys me? Okay, so if you want to play a Game Boy game, 
um, or like a Game Boy Advance game or, or DS game in the correct aspect oh, ratio yeah, yeah, on the 3DS, yeah. you have to like hold the start button as you're booting them up, yeah. which is the most unwieldy nonsense I've ever heard of in my life. They made a, an option to view the game as it's supposed to be viewed a fucking secret. An yeah, I, I've off like I've had to tell people about like many times because I often see people complaining about how DS games look on the 3DS. I'm like, well, you can just hold down like you hold down the start button and then you get original resolution. Everybody's like always like amazed when they find that out when I tell them. <laughs> I almost like, really because Nintendo hates options so much. I almost wonder if this is just developers sneaking them in when Miyamoto's well, not looking. It was like, in Miyamoto the it was in the three DS user manual, so That's fair, but I mean you know they it, it, and the manual was written. The three DS might not be in the Japanese. The three well. DS user manual is how I discovered uh that there were DSI specific games. <laughs> like the that were DSI game cartridge cartridges because oh, yeah, no. it listed the it listed those as something that the three DS could play. <laughs> Of course, my favorite thing about the 3DS user manual was the little, the little warnings about what you're not supposed to do with it. I was post I posted those the other day because I was thinking about them. The one where it's like telling you not to put it in your back pocket, and it just looks like they're you're pooping out the the 3DS because <laughs> because it doesn't show the clothes, so it just looks like there's just a hole, and the 3DS no, is coming out of it no. while they're sitting. <laughs> Please, I'm begging you to stop the lane. Have I not suffered enough? And then there's one where it looks like you're like shooting a laser eye beam into the 3DS. That's pretty funny. That one's pretty good. And then there's one where the 3DS is like sweating in an air conditioner. It's, like, <laughs> it's just things like that. But yeah, what were you gonna say, Biss? Something about the the emulated stuff. I can't remember. You I was talking about. I was. I'm sorry. I was talking about how Nintendo made the N64 games dimmer. Oh yeah, basically Nintendo hates options and they suck and I hate them, and they're bad. <laughs> and then they made a load of games dimmer on the fucking Wii U eShop or whatever. And then on the classic, they don't. The SNES Classic <laughs> is the, oh, is, like, like, doesn't dim the games when the same games were dimmed on the Nintendinus, the Wii U enus. Why? That's why I'm going to play The Legend of Zelda, by the way, is on the NES Classic, because I realized, oh, I can stream from those consoles now, so what should I stream from them? I was thinking, well, maybe Zelda. I haven't streamed Zelda before. I haven't streamed Zelda anything. Zelda anything? I don't know why that sounds like a shitpost to me, Zelda anything. <laughs> the Legend of Zelda anything. It's just about whatever. I'm going to die. Oh yeah, Monaco, that sucks. Also, they took down the Pokemon fan game wiki, Pokemon Uranium, Pokemon Crystal Clear, and, the and they made it so you can't e very easily find ROMs of anything, not even like things that aren't even Nintendo. I should link Super Mario uh, Brothers Online. There's, yeah, there's one that uh, that there's a website where I get these from now that Shiny gave to me. They'll I should post in the Discord server sometime because it's very good. It's just got everything. <laughs> you don't get like different rips of each game. Like they they've only archived one rip of. Oh come on! Ash, I'm gonna destroy you. You don't have a choice of the uh, of the rip that you get to Ash, use, I'm but. Come to your house and I'm gonna destroy you. The games are all there. For the record, Why? Ash just said. For the record, for people watching the vault, Ash just said. When will Pokemon Uh oh and Stinky come out? This is probably the last zone I'm gonna do on this stream. <laughs> is Lab is Labyrinth Zone testing you, honey? No, I'm just talking about the time. Oh, okay. <laughs> Labyrinth Zone is a piece of shit though. I was hoping maybe we could do the whole game, but it's a little bit longer than I thought. It's not quite as short as like Super Mario Bros. 2. <laughs> Although, of course, that one's short because I use the shortcuts and everything, but... <laughs> you gotta do that mod still, Biss, that you wanted to do, and then we'll come back and stream all the levels of Super Mario 2. Super Mario Bros. 2. Yeah, that's pretty good. I, I'm gonna be honest, though. It's mm -hmm. really fucking hard to do sprite hacks if <laughs> I have the sp I have most of the sprites done. It's just important them being stinky. Not I'll the spikes. 
I just gotta find which project, what where the folder the project is. <laughs> uh oh, you got a spike bug. You, you know what's something bug. that blew my mind when I was younger? Yeah. It was when I realized that the the Game Boy Advance and the uh, the Nintendo DS were lower resolution than older game consoles. Like they're lower resolution than the NES or the Super NES. Wait, that surprised you? Yeah, I didn't know that. I thought, like, oh, these are nicer looking consoles. They must be higher resolution, too. <laughs> like, I didn't know. <laughs> I'd never played any of those games yet at that point. I'm shaking my head at you. I'm shaking my head at you. <clears throat> <laughs> I'm shaking my head at you. <laughs> oh, God. Because I thought better meant higher resolution. You're just like you're like the average person in the camera market. How many megapixels does it have? <laughs> oh god! It's me. gotta have seventy-eight megapixels. <laughs> it is fucking hilarious because like actively giving it more megapixels makes the image more grainy. Stop it! Bad <laughs> camera manufacturers. Stop making big numbers to impress people. Like the bits. Oh, have they a, have a lovely score work time, Ash. Punch school work in the face. I don't like this Something part of the level. This part of the level is kind of spongy. Wait, do you These like things any with the spikes. this level? Yeah. Just this part bugs me. Are you- wait, are you- oh. There we go, but I gotta hang on it now. Of it water well levels in Sonic, this is like the least offensive of them. I think because it just gives you bubbles so often. <laughs> I'm not struggling with the air at all. Like, what about compared to, like, Hydro City Zone, though? Mmm, I never really had fond memories of that one, so... Are you In fact, I think I didn't like it very much, because I kept drowning. Are you, are you drown in Hydro City Zone?! Yeah. I, have I drown or come close to drowning in I... basically every water level in Sonic, other than this one. <laughs> I have not heard the drowning music in Hydro City Zone. Since I was like a bab. I mean, I run into the time limit in those Sonic games all the time too, so I, which is like some... ten minutes. The experiences you have with classic Sonic ah. games very much confuse me, and that's why I I'm ran into the time limit all the time in Sonic Mania, for instance. I mean, Sonic Mania has like big levels, so I guess it kind of makes sense if you don't. Keep Not it. this again. For some reason, I was thinking if we want to stream Sonic Mania, I'd have to buy the game again. But then I realized, oh yeah, I have a capture card now, so I can just play the Switch version. <laughs> yeah. Do you have the DLC? No. You don't have the DLC? No, I wasn't interested. <laughs> oh, Lano. Elaineness. If I was at work right now, I'd buy you it, because it'd make a more <laughs> interesting stream if you played Encore mode. <laughs> Encore mode just thinks you to play didn't... the game again for the most part. It just like, didn't seem like it. Well, like, I didn't feel like playing the game again, so there wasn't really anything in the DLC for me. <laughs> That's fair. Okay, you know how much air you have left? Only when the music cue kicks in. And I also think occasionally bubbles come out of you and you could maybe count them. Maybe? I'm not even certain about that, though. Don't quote me on Bubbles it. come out of your butt? <laughs> no. No. Bubble no. butt? Yes, but that doesn't mean a- that's not what you described. Funny bubble butt? <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing the Cassie. Well, later, please, why do this to me? I've already got one baby in my life. I don't need two. <laughs> I don't want to be a struggling single mom. <laughs> Single fairy. <laughs> Single fairy. Make my own way through the world. <laughs> Bubble butt! Bubble butt. You should play Bubble Bubble on stream. Oh yeah, that's something I could play on the NES Classic. Bubble Bubble's on there. I love that game. You should put that on NES... Uh, is it on NES Online? I think so. Because then we could play it I together. I mean, if I mean, if I want to play Bubble Bubble of all things, we could maybe do I that. I love Bubble Bubble. Well, sometimes we play games together that's because it's the game that you love. <laughs> so, wait, what games? Do, what games do we play on on NES Online? Well, no, I just mean in general. That's fair. When I mean, we pick I, games I mean, to play, 
I'll be a lot of it's stuff that you like, and then you're having me play it. I'll be up for Bubble Bubble on one condition. What? Kirby's Dream Course. <laughs> I've never done Did the multiplayer on that. I've done. The, I've gone through the single player campaign. Oh fuck! You're gonna completely wreck me then. I cannot beat like the even the easiest courses on like oh. single player. Multiplayer is the only. I used to save states a little game. bit on that, but not too much. Safe state. I basically just use them for practicing. I didn't use it to like cheese the levels or anything. But I did practice at Kirby's Dream Course. <laughs> Although on the other hand, it's been a long time since I played it, and I probably don't remember how to play at this point. So. <laughs> for a second, there, my um, brain got really tired and thought you said Kirby's Cheese Course. <laughs> also, on uh, Bubble Bobble, there's a secret ending that you can only get in multiplayer, which I've obviously never seen because I only played it by myself. So we could you've go for that. Never seen it? No. Like you've never even seen pictures of it? Well, why would I? That would be a spoiler. But how'd you know it's there if it's a secret that you've never seen? I've never looked at what it actually is, but I know it's there. Okay. Awfully bold of you to assume we'll be able to beat it together, but okay. Like, like I've never, I've never been to the Eiffel Tower, but I know it's there. You know. <laughs> you know what it fucking looks like. I've never been to the Marianas Trench. But you know. I don't know what that looks like. You have a rough idea, at least. <laughs> oh my god! I, does anybody want to hear a good story? Like a good story, right? Do you like the two places I picked, which was the Eiffel Tower and and the Marianas Trench? <laughs> They're pretty good places. I can't. Okay, I can so, never remember if there's an S on the end of that or if it's just Mariana Trench. I think it's Marianas. But anyway, okay, what are you gonna any, say, Miss? Anybody who wants to hear a good story, right? Okay. Uh, it's in the SCP universe, but you don't need knowledge of SCP to understand it, right? Look up, found at the bottom of the Marianas Trench on YouTube, and if you I may can have find seen that it, one. yeah, watch the. Uh, Which, the how, how does that one go book. again? Let's see if I can. Let's see if I did hear that one. Well, I just told people to watch it, so I'm not gonna spoil it. Oh, isn't it the? Uh, I'm gonna give no, a big thing. Don't spoil it! Don't spoil it! No. I'm just trying to figure out if, if. Uh, well, here I'll mute myself on the stream and just ask you. Serious? Okay. Yes, it's that one. Okay, I remembered which one it was. <laughs> this confirmed. Okay. And I didn't okay, spoil so the they... stream. Oh no! What's up? And then I died. Oh no! Immediately after we <laughs> continuing. <laughs> and then I die again! Horrible. No! Why does this you always happen? I hate that you don't keep rings. You died to an orbinaut with no orbs. Exactly. Like. My God. Yeah, I it's so anyway, so if you find the upload on YouTube by the Volgan, I think he did a really good reading of the story. He's pretty good reading. So that's the good. that's the channel I watched for SCP readings when I was into that. Yeah. You love the potato sack one. Yes, that was good. Now I'm into more stories that are supposed. At least supposedly real. <laughs> I can't stand real stories because they're always boring. Like somebody's like, I went to my car and there was a murderer, but I it went all around. And it's like, yeah, I don't oh, know. I guess like, they're all kind of samey, but I mean, I stay interested. I guess because they're not like, they're usually sort of just written in people's voices because, you know, they're just writing it out as opposed to making it a story. And that's more interesting to me for some reason. Okay, okay, so his I guess is, I'm just, I, like... I guess with everything, I'm just interested in realism. <laughs> well, actually, that's for the some reason, reason why I like at the bottom of the Marianas Trench. is Even though it's a fantasy story, it's written from the perspective of, norm of a normal person telling you what happened. Mm -hmm. And that's why I enjoy it. And that's the reason why well, I, I think I actually movie. listened to that whole one, actually. That's the reason why I don't like um, most literature, is a lot of it's from thir like third person. Or it's yeah, like when I tried to write stuff, I tried to just write it like I would talk. Yeah. Oh god, have you ever heard the Bad Sex Awards? Oh yes, I've heard of that. Yeah, okay, but people not I think, know I think you and I went over that before. Yeah. Basically, it's awards for bad sex scenes in books. And like, all of them have like Oh yeah, we were laughing our butts off over that. Yeah, like, like, nothing like a year or two be... ago. <laughs> yeah. 
Like, they can never just describe things happening. It's always, mm, he explored the moors of the butt cheeks, <laughs> like the rolling hills of Yorkshire. And it's like, just fucking say what happened. You <laughs> self-indulgent prick. <laughs> And then some of them are just bad. Like, there was this one I was reading out to Arrow a couple days ago, right? <laughs> fact, let, me see, let me see if I can fucking find it. Let me see if I can fucking find it. I want to read this out to you. It's great. I guess one thing I don't really like too much on this stage is the music is a little boring. I like the music on the other stages a little better. Okay, I'm gonna read this, right? Uh huh. I need you to be patient, because the last line is where it's all made. He's almost weightless. When he enters me, it hurts, and my pain belongs to the subterranean world, primitive as the clay. His body is slacker than I expected. A small porch begins his waist. My, I and wanna settles interject in a downward... something. Okay, interject. By my, by my understanding, usually if that hurts, there's some kind of problem. Yeah, it's it's not good. <laughs> exactly. Again, I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, no, I don't think it's supposed to hurt. Okay, so this is probably a story written from the first person perspective of of somebody who probably has a vagumbris, and the writer <laughs> probably does not. So that explains yeah, it. Exactly. But okay. <laughs> his body is slacker than I expected. A small paunch begins at his waist and settles what? in a downward parabola. The spike sucked wrong. me in. His pubic hair is red. His erect penis is a surprise. Although I had imagined what it would feel like, read about them, seen them represented in toilet walls and magazines. I didn't see it before he entered me, but afterwards... Oh, Monaco, the answer for that is because, like, writing it is, like, all they can manage. <laughs> so, <laughs> to put it in, like, the, like, what's the word? <laughs> to put it as, like, best I can. Oh. Anyway, continue, please. Anyway, anyway, where was I? Okay, his pubic hair is red, his erect penis is surprised, <laughs> although I'd imagine what they'd feel like. Christ. Read about them even, seen them represented on toilet walls and magazines. I didn't see it before it entered me, but afterwards it was small and sticky and amusing. I was to touch <laughs> it, but I didn't dare. I don't know the etiquette. He is 20 more years older than me. This is sex! What? That's why I want. I I was so desperate. I just needed to tell you the line. This is sex. It's the best one sentence I... ending to any paragraph I've ever seen. <laughs> I love how the ending this is. This basically... is Halloween. You should say it like that. No, I won't. Because <laughs> I know I have more dignity than that. But I love how the last few bits are basically. Yeah, his penis was small and funny. Um, he's older than me. That that's sex. Like, what the heck is this? Oh, fuck. This is Halloween, this is Halloween. That's a good question, Monaco. The answer is probably, um... <laughs> the Dunning-Kruger effect. Probably. <laughs> also, also just, like, fucking, I don't know. Like they, I said, they've heard about it. Yeah, I'm like... They, they, they're not actually getting it, so... The best they can do is write about it. And also, it's like, also, it's like, it's probably like a telephone game. Like they've read it happen in books. Yeah. Oh, and yeah. They, that's something I, I think I remember it. reading about that on TV tropes of all places. Was like where it's just like, you can tell the writer has only read about it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I'm so. This part of the stage I don't like either. <laughs> There's like a couple parts that are bugging me. But to be honest, I think they bugged me the original time I played this as well. Like I told like I say this is my favorite. Like, but it's still not like one of my favorite games ever. <laughs> so that's just kinda how I feel about the Sonic series as a whole, I guess. Why did it <laughs> Why did it block the term Cornhub? Because <laughs> it knows what you meant. <laughs> the Autobot is far too fucking powerful. Oh fuck, you like the Vulcan as well? I'm glad. Ouch. 
Boom, 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 boom. Oh, stop it, stop it. Potatoes are better than both of those. Fuck you. You can't make cereal out of potatoes. I'll, eat, I'll make cereal out of potatoes. And I'll eat it in front of you. <laughs> Wow, that's one hell of a threat. You're gonna eat some disgusting, awful, hard mashed potato milk, gross garbage, and look how much, me in the eye as you do it. How much potato can you add to a Rice Krispie treat before people notice? I can't believe Monaco is the new Ash. <laughs> the bot is bullying me. Yeah, that bot is there. Oh no! Oh no! Elena, can I ask you a question? The auto mod is there to prevent, like, harassment. And instead, it just prevents people from saying silly things. It prevents people from talking. <laughs> you can't harass if you can't speak. <laughs> Elena, can we please get rid of auto mod? It's a fucking. Co oh, at this point, the only it's reason like a meme. there is to dunk on Ash. <laughs> I mean, it's there preemptively, like in case what? like some stinkers show up. Like I said, as I was talking about last week when I was streaming. Like, I heard about people complaining, like, the, they're starting out streaming, and they hate it because everyone's so mean to them. And then they're, oh, they're going back. I, tell you, I was talking about, yeah, and then I was talking about how, like, I've, I think I've had, like, two mean comments. And they, they were, were like, stopped. and, like, one of them was on YouTube, not even on Twitch, so... <laughs> Do you know what the first meme comment I got on the internet was? What? It's on DeviantArt, I posted an, uh, a piece of art, and then somebody replied saying, Even Batman thinks you're a dick butt. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, I think, I think, really? That's like, uh, like the two, like as far as I know, that's it. Like I don't, like, people just don't try to bother me. Really, <laughs> you know, I get left alone for the most part, for whatever reason. You have like, you have like, don't bully me, and it, okay, no, you have like, okay, so you have like, just kind of tiny little dainty leaf lying on the side of the pavement. Energy, nobody <laughs> really like. I don't know. You don't attract people who are bad. Yeah, they like, like I talk about, like, even when I was in school, I never got bullied. Never once had anybody try to bully me in school, or oh, be mean God. to me I, in any way. I didn't even go to school, and I got bullied the hell out of. Yeah, I never, never, never been bullied. Somebody tried to shit on me once when I was a kid. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> that's a statement. It really fucking is. <laughs> yeah, no, nobody ever did anything to me. In fact, I had the opposite happen. People would randomly like gift, give me gifts of things. Like, I had people just, like, give me Hot Wheels. <laughs> I love the idea of just the offering of Hot Wheels to the lane. <laughs> yeah. I think people would give me, like, I got, like, a Pokemon book from someone. Just stuff like that. Or no, it was a Bionicle book, I think. Oh, and, oh, like, I had a friend, a friend just randomly gave me a game one time, or gave me two games. Because he didn't want them anymore. He's like, you want them? Specifically to me, he gives them. Like, <laughs> like, why am I the person who you just give things to? <laughs> like, <laughs> It really does suck being bullied anymore. Uh -huh. Hey, Laney. Yeah? It, 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 what's your favorite Bionic? The green one. You know what I love about Bionicle? What? It implies the, exist the existence of an onicle. Oh yeah, I remember you did this. You did this in my chat the other day. Yeah, I did this in your chat the other day. Yeah, oh, like, sorry, uh, that that's still sorry. continues. Like, the getting gifts from people. Like, I, that still just happens. Like, on the internet. Well, usually it's Steam games now, is the gifts that I get, but... <laughs> I used to give you gifts when I had money. Yeah. Well, I mean, just, like, from people I don't even know very well. That's probably because you're cute. <laughs> oh. Good. And wholesome. Chan says, I like brown bionicle. Yeah, that one's pretty good, too. Yeah, the brownonicle. The brown... On the brown I like the idea brown. that, like, all the bionicles of a certain color are just the same. 
That's the mononical. <laughs> it kick. Hey, Blaney. Mm-hmm. Buy me a bionical. Bionical? A bi bionical. Buy me one. Buy me a bionical. <laughs> and then put it in my G string. <laughs> <laughs> Why is that your go-to lately? <laughs> your go-to today, that is. Not even lately. Just today. I don't know, it's just in my head, and I love the Oh, is this one of those looping things? Did they start that with the first game? Yes, it is a looping thing. A vertical loop. Otherwise known as a loop. I can't get out of it. Also, um, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, another reason why I don't think I got bullied was because of the school I went to. Uh, the art school that I went to was kind of basically just where all the kids who normally would get bullied went to. So none of the kids were bullies. They were just... <laughs> they were the kids who would normally be getting bullied. Well, it's a fucking wildlife sanctuary for nerds. Basically. Like, people would come to school, like, in cosplay all the time. And apparently they still do. My sister goes to that school now. And apparently... Apparently there's, like, a girl who comes to school wearing, like, ram horns every day. Is that a fucking Homestuck? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> oh my god, honey. Oh, I so want you to read Homestuck one day. I don't like this section. I can't Why seem to like jump. Why do you have a big jump instead of a load of little jumps? Because I can't. Wait, what do you mean you can't? This is the only kind of jump I can do. Wait, is this just how this system works in this game? What the fuck is... Why is oh, it... Oh, there we go. Why... I don't know why it didn't work the rest of the time. Oh, I see. You have to not press a button. Like, I'm trying to pre hold in the direction I want to jump in, and that makes it go small. You have to press nothing. Just jump. What? It was confusing. What? This is kind of weird. Yeah. That's not how I expected it to be. Oh, Sonic. Careful. Does this have something to do with the speed cap, maybe? Well, I mean, my school was a public school, too. It was just... Like... It wasn't just the school that just everybody goes to. You had to like, it wasn't a private school, like you didn't have to pay. You just had to get enrolled in it. I hope your teacher's got the, the fucking face. Look, you know, that's me. No, I hope your teacher's got fired from that I was about to say something. Much it's a magnet face. academy. A magnanomy. Ah, poop. Magnet as in it's supposed to attract people with certain interests. I mean, that makes sense, yeah. <laughs> it's a magnet for people who want to do the arts. Aww. For people who want to do the arts. Oh, for fuck's sake. I okay, think they I had one, I think they had one for, like, medical stuff as well. And then there was one that was just for, like, math and science, I think. Okay, I hope they get fired soon, then. At some point, maybe. <laughs> Paying for school is disgusting and nobody should have to do it. Fight me, yeah, I don't uh, disagree. Well, all the public schools, well, this one in particular, you do have, they do, like, ask you for money for, like, certain classes to, like, pay for the supplies and everything. Um, although, around here at least, there's, like, alternate plans for that. Like, if you can't pay, they won't, like, kick you out. Hmm. So. <laughs> it's just kind of, it's basically just, like, like, I don't think it's, like, mandatorily enforced, like, or at least not if, like, you can prove your income is too low, then they won't, like, make you do it. But it's sort of, like, your donation to make sure that the school keeps going. <laughs> Did you know that originally this game was gonna have a, a goggle item that Sonic could wear in the water? And also <laughs> that Sonic has an alternate running animation that's unused for being underwater, where he, like, kind of waves <laughs> his arms through and, like, paddles slightly with them? It's cute. Sonic and these- I always thought Sonic was, like, cute in these older games. He's, like, small and round. And cute. Yeah. I yeah, remember- so I remember- I remember saying when he slides down- uh, like, I think it was on this stage when he slides down the waterfalls, he was- he was a slidey butt. That's what I referred to it as. <laughs> I, I recall. Hey, Shan, if you're tired enough that you're getting upset about stuff, maybe you should just go to sleep, sleep. Oh, then again, we are oh. almost done, so I don't know. Just do what- I mean- Yeah, I, once I we're done with this act, the stream will be done. 
But yeah, classic this, Sonic's cute. And this game gives me a little bit of Speedy Egbert vibes. Just a little bit, because Speedy Egbert was all pre-rendered stuff, and this isn't, so there's a difference there, but... Kind of the music it's... sound, and like... <laughs> and the colors. The asset, a lot of the assets are trying to look slightly 3D, though, so I can yeah. imagine. But yeah, Classic Sonic's Q, and I think Q is good. Because Q and Cool are, like, good offsets. Plus, Speedy Egbert is, like, didn't come out very much longer after this game did. Same decade. Uh, no! <laughs> oh my god... When he's sliding on his butt, it still makes the, like, the spin move sound effect. If you press down. That makes sense. Like, you just <laughs> start spinning for a frame and then instantly unspin. Or it's like his- I just like to imagine his, like, butt is, like, spinning or something. No! Like, he's, he's revving up his- his, no, his butt. No, Elena, stop he's ruining like, like, everything <laughs> I love. Why don't- don't just feel like- They each start spinning like an individual- like, each one spins like an individual wheel. No. Why- <laughs> And he goes rolling down the hill. Only I'm gonna come to your house. Okay, that wasn't and very good. Break every door and window in your house. And then and I won't be able to sleep anymore. Yeah, and you won't be able to sleep. Anymore. Actually, I'm just gonna destroy the entire house. I'm gonna bring every fucking wall down. How that make you feel? Well, I'd be able to get some sleep then. Wait, why would you? The entire house is gone. Yeah. How would you think I sleep in the sleep? house? You don't sleep in the ha Where do you sleep? <laughs> in the... In the... In the toilet. Well, the, the toilet's in the house, so I'm gonna smash the toilet no, it isn't. and unplug it. Unplug... <laughs> unplug the toilet! <laughs> and then, then we were talking about acoustic versus electric toilet. Okay, so basically earlier on, Cassie was like role-playing in a server and was like, poops in the toilet, and I'm like... Unplug yeah, because that's the kind of role toilet. plays that uh, Cassie gets up to. Yeah. So I'm like, unplug your toilet. And she's like, no! Plugs it back in, and I unplug it again. And then, and then like, Elena's like, why does she have an electric toilet? And I'm like, she doesn't like acoustic. <laughs> so and then, then I made a post just... about, do you prefer an electric or an acoustic toilet? <laughs> <laughs> Somebody oh said, God. I'd like an electric, but I can only afford an acoustic. Oh god, that's sad. That's and somebody really said the acoustic one has better- has richer sound. I just love the idea that, like, somehow- like, I'm a- <laughs> okay, so let's be honest here, right? Let's be real here, right? So an electric uh -huh. toilet somehow listens in for the little fart noises and amplifies them. <laughs> that's a bit spin -pop, right? <laughs> Did you know that there are- there's, like, smart toilets? Yeah, I we know found those when we toilets. yeah because we were looking at because when we were looking to get a new toilet recently, uh, that came up. <laughs> Isn't smart toilet? I'm glad that this is what I come back to. It says a lot about our society. Penny Kirby says it does. It, yeah, you're kind of right, Monaco. To be honest, <laughs> it's like I fit, me. Elena My community Cassio revolves like around butt jokes. <laughs> Me, Elena, and Cassie have like a spectrum of oh, jokes no. where it's like Cassie's jokes are exclusively about things coming out of the anus. <laughs> My jokes are mostly about the cheeks, and Elena's in the middle. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna reload because I'm back in the same spot. I might as well have more lives than that. You know what I'm saying? No, I don't. I like how this has evolved into like almost entirely just save state. Loading. I love As I get into harder and harder parts of, the, of this stage. Yeah, that too. Did you know Labyrinth Zone was originally going to be the second level? <laughs> I kind of would like to practice enough at this game to be able to do it. Like, I was trying, like, years ago when I first had this on the 3DS, I liked it enough that I was going to try and practice to be able to do the whole thing in one go. But I never, like, kept at it. Like I did with Super Mario Bros. 2. <laughs> Because ultimately, I just like that game more. <laughs> I didn't like Sonic. Like, I didn't like it enough to to do that with it. Although playing it again, I kind of would like to. 
Because I feel like I would feel cool if I could do it all in one go. <laughs> Your interest in this game continually disturbs me more and more. <laughs> oh. Because well, like, maybe, maybe, you came maybe. into this expecting me to like like this less than I used to. But I've yeah, got, I pretty like, much feel the same about it. I guess you haven't learned as much as I thought you had. <laughs> like, I thought you'd been through some like life-changing character arc shit, but now it's like... I guess at the end of the day you just like basic platformers and that's just how it is. I mean, I still think I prefer Sonic CD over this at this point. I think this, uh, like playing this again, cements that for me, that this is no longer my, my very favorite. And well, instead Sonic it's Sonic CD. CD. Sonic CD is basically just this with way easier level design and also a 100% that's like exploration based. Yeah, which I liked much better than the bonus stages. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. And that, those were really fun streams when I was just exploring the stages and trying to find the, the hidden things that I needed. I really enjoyed those a lot. Did you like those ones too, Biss? Wait, which ones again? In Sonic CD, when I was searching for all the hidden stuff to get the good ending. The streams? Yeah, the streams yeah. are pretty good. I yeah, I really, really enjoyed those. Saga to watch unfold. Yeah. <laughs> oh, poop. I think, I, think more game, I think more Sonic games could do I mean, exploration-based good endings as opposed to special stage ones. Because mm -hmm. the special stages are often... Well, they're usually completely different gameplay, and you hardly ever get to play them. So it's hard to practice. It's kind of mostly supposed to be something for people who like just play the games a lot, I guess. You know, <laughs> they don't expect you to try and one hundred percent them. Like, you know, if you're not really into them and playing a lot. <laughs> I mean, I guess that's what they have in the the later Sonic games. Is it's all just exploration because it's just getting red rings and things like that. No, mm, but it's not part of a good ending thing. No, that's true. Actually, I, I guess I they don't really that. have good endings anymore. It's just, there's, it's just the ending, and you just get it. Yeah, kind of. I think starting like Sonic Adventure was like that. Where it's just Sonic Adventure, yeah, it's just, it just end. has a story. Mm -hmm. And two. It's like a bunch of two. Same. Yeah, basically, I don't think there's been a good ending to a Sonic game since like. Well, Sonic, Sonic Mania okay, did so, it, of course. Okay, so Sonic Mania did it for obvious reasons. Aw, oh, poop. It was my Sonic first drowning, because I missed the bubble. The bubble was Sonic... right there, and I missed it somehow. You want us wild? What? Sonic 4 Episode 1 has a good ending, Sonic 4 Episode 2 doesn't. You cannot get a good <laughs> ending in Sonic 4 Episode 2. <laughs> also, what was the awe about, Monaco? <laughs> did, oh, you like, need to sleep. Did you just see what happened, honey? Oh god. What? Did you... We I'm have to start over. That. I'm gonna clip that. What happened? Aww. Have a nice sleep, Monaco. What Both if Sonic, Sonic was real, Penny Kirby says. We may not even get past this act, because I probably have to get going here soon. Good decision? Oh, about sleeping. <laughs> oh, I didn't... Oh, I did press the button. What did you clip, Biss? I'm trying to clip a, f a glitch that you missed. Oh. A glitch. Yeah. The good ending in Sonic 4 Episode 1 is just literally that Sonic turns super in the last two seconds of the last How the glitch stole Sonic. How the glitch stole Christmas Island. Oh, you fucking remembered Christmas Island. I'm proud of you. <laughs> of course I did. You keep mentioning it the last couple days. Yeah, just infinitely. I just always mention it. I never talk about anything else anymore. I really want everyone to know about Christmas Island. Yeah, because he doesn't come from Green Fucking Hill Zone. Why was it? Why? Oh, yeah, it was because like the designer was like, oh, he's a little bit like Santa Claus. So he comes from Christmas Land. Also, I have a clip coming up. It's a very good clip. It's a clip with some dip. I'm glad that people are clipping my stream more often. <laughs> Again. Yeah, it's pretty fun to clip. I feel physically ill all of a sudden. I'm not sure oh, no. exactly why. Well, it's a good thing I'm ending soon. Yeah, that means <laughs> hopefully we finish in case I have to go more. Oh no. Hope you don't have to do that. 
Uh, it'd, be, it'd be fun. I haven't vomited in like almost a decade. <laughs> Your I definition of fun is concerning. At this point, I'm trying to become like a rat if I'm just incapable of doing it. <laughs> Why do I struggle so with this so hard? Gosh dang it. In Sonic 3D Blast, there's like an entire mechanic about spinning the other way, using weird turntables in the ground to make Sonic do a twirl there that breaks go. through things that normal spinning doesn't, it's weird. Spinning the other way? Like, like, around in circles, like a pirouette. Oh. Around... spinning around Oh, I managed to get that. Oh, also, please. I put, I put, I put the thing, the clip in chat. Oh, come on, Bubble, come on, Bubble. I got it! <laughs> oh, God! That was tense. Did you see me get it? Did you see me get the bubble? I'm watching. Oh my god, that was like absolute last second. Yes! <laughs> Can't believe I did that. <laughs> I did it almost a day! Oh, that would've been great. Almost a day? Oh my god. Yeah, I'm just. Could you imagine if I was just one of those organisms that has like a one way digestive tract? Like, I eat food and I have to vomit out later. I just can't <laughs> live. Or what about those mites where they just collect no, it all? No, we're not. No. And the other it. end of them. No. Don't talk about the constipation mites, please. <laughs> I knew you were going to go for the constipation mites. I was like, Elena. You told me that they weren't herself. really constipated if they can't poop. <laughs> yeah, they're not constipated because constipation is an inability to poop. If you don't poop, <laughs> that's not the same as having an ability. That's like, like, like you, you can't have a flightless. Donkey. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a safe state here. Just Sorry. at this checkpoint. Uh. You know, we could probably find a rom hack that adds continues to something. <laughs> I don't need it. We could probably find a ROM hack that does that and also puts the spin dash back in. I don't need it. <laughs> you do need it. I don't need it. You do need it, Luigi. Go to the bathroom and get a <laughs> continue. <laughs> get a continue, Luigi. Oh, no. oh, that was that reminds me of something really funny Vinny did the other day when yeah. he, when Gordon Ramsay came up. He, in, he does a good Gordon Ramsay impression, and in the Gordon Ramsay voice, he was like, "Go to the bathroom, <laughs> chef." Okay, I have a question. Oh right? my god, who would win in a four battle, right? Out of Gordon Ramsay and Chef Boyardee. Chef Boyardee makes me think of that terrible SpongeBob thing that you made me watch. <laughs> Oh no! I think I know what you mean! It's been months since I've seen it, like, the one where Mr. Krabs and Jeff Boyardee have a rivalry for some reason. Yeah. And Squidward's like, Mr. Krabs, what you have against Beefaroni? Or something like that. <laughs> it was terrible, I hate it. What do you have against Beefaroni, Mr. Krabs? I can't do it. I hate that I just remembered it. I can't do this! <laughs> The same thing happens every time. I try and do it differently. The exact same thing happens every single time. That's why I've made Elena. the save state here, so I can like at least try it more often. Elena, do you want, do you want a pro tip? What? Don't. Okay, here's a, here's a pro tip, right? You don't have to go fast. <laughs> Just, okay, trust me. There's literally no reason to go fast in this other than the water. As long as you're keeping pace with the water, don't worry about catching old Eggman. I mean, that's what I'm trying to do. No, it's... Okay, trust me, you don't have to do it. Hush, dang it! See, now I've gone too... What? <laughs> I, mean, I mean, I have a feeling you're gonna ignore my advice and suffer for Now it, I went you? too slow. Well, even if you even if you're under the water, it's fine. Just just you know, as long as you, like, okay, so you've been classically been going too quickly. Just take it, just be careful, just, just take it easy. <laughs> this Rio, 
The Bisrio Super name. Super Show. Bisrio in Super Show. I know. Oh my God! Do you remember back when I used to go swing your ass from side to side? Come on, it's time to go do the Bisrio. I think I glitched Take the water one. to not move. Okay, it's good then. Oh no, here you it comes. <laughs> okay, that was a quick turn. I mean, it just did something weird there, which I thought was a thing that it wasn't. The water took pity on me and gave you a head start. I made it up here. Okay, so. Oh, Eggman, run away! Look at all the little seals. And that's why I told Sonic you has to passed. Go. Because it doesn't matter how long it takes. You just have to get to the top of the section. And you are rushing. Starlight zone. Oh, this is the best zone. And this is where we're going to leave off for the stream. <laughs> so that is Sonic the Hedgehog. So far. Ish. It's the Sonic, the Hedge. We'll do the Hog next time. <laughs> you know, what? that was the worst wording I could have gone for since it's this. Do the Feral Hog. Elena, please don't make that mean. You know how it spumbuses me. Yeah. It's because I'm trying to spumbus you. Why are you doing that to me? Why are you responsible? <laughs> and then it's so nice that you came on your stream just to hang out with me and then you try to spawn me. <laughs> well, I hope everyone enjoyed that. <laughs> the game the game was harder than I remembered it. I remembered it being hard. It's harder than I even remembered it being. <laughs> I cannot see what you see in this game, TBH. <laughs> Yeah, I'm enjoying playing through it again. And it was it's always fun having you here, Biss. <laughs> Wait, really? What the fuck? Yes. That's gross. It's always very nice to have you on my stream. It's like they say, if you enjoy spending time with Biss on your stream, then there's something deeply wrong with you and you should seek help. <laughs> no. <laughs> Everybody else likes having you here too. Aww. I hope you have a nice sleep shower. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you, everyone. Um, I'll be back tomorrow with Cassie. We'll be playing uh, viewer levels, viewer submitted levels for Super Mario Maker 2. I gotta go download those tonight. And I'll be ready with them tomorrow. And then Thursday is near Automata again. And I'm thinking of starting a Zelda playthrough. And uh, hopefully, I'll have plenty of people there who know the game who can potentially help me out. <laughs> I think that would be fun. And, uh, yeah, so that's the schedule for the week. Uh, unless Biss wants to stream Horus or something, or if you want to do another Horus and Sonic 4 stream this mm, week. Time. Like, maybe time. Friday. It'd really help if you could put a couple Bionicles in my G-string. I don't really know any sense <laughs> of it. Chances, why is there an Austrian flag? Wait, where? Where's the Austrian flag? I didn't in see the... In the border? Uh, <laughs> That's a good fucking question. I don't know why there'd be an Austrian flag here. <laughs> but yeah, um, I will see you tomorrow, everyone. See you in chat tomorrow, everybody. Have a nice night. <laughs> the start screen. Goodbye. Right? Let's wait for the start screen and see what the Austrian flag is. Oh, well, it's too late. <laughs> I closed it. <laughs> okay, well, I don't know what the Austrian flag looks like anyway. Oh, I think it's the banner. Red, white, red. <laughs> All right. Oh, well. See you tomorrow, everyone, with Cassie. <laughs> See ya. Bye. -bye. Bye.